Empowering Suffolk's Future Suffolk is one of the first areas of the country to be invited to enter into a new style of devolution deal with the government, the county deal, which would give the county council greater decision-making powers and control of more than half a billion pounds of public funding. As a large rural county made up of market towns, coastal communities and larger urban towns, Suffolk is an ideal place to demonstrate how levelling up can work in different geographies. Devolution would mean that key decisions in areas such as housing, regeneration, transport and adult education would be taken locally, rather than in Whitehall, by people who know, understand and love Suffolk. The County Council would also receive control of a significant new investment fund worth $480 million over 30 years. Together, we could spend this on local priorities. So, what is Suffolk being offered? Devolution puts power in the hands of local people. At the moment, councillors choose the leader of Suffolk County Council, but under the proposed deal, the leader would be directly elected by Suffolk's residents. Every four years, you would be given an extra vote and empowered to elect both your local councillor and the leader of the council. Devolution would enable us to work with local stakeholders to shape adult education in Suffolk. It would allow us to tailor education to the needs of our residents and demands of the local job market, ensuring that our workforce is equipped with the skills that matter most for Suffolk. There are currently more than 200 brownfield sites across Suffolk which could be appropriate for development. Instead of bidding for funding on a case-by-case -case basis, with the deal, Suffolk would receive a 5.8 million lump sum to regenerate this land into affordable homes and business units. The proposed deal would also give Suffolk a joined-up budget for transport to help us deliver key local priorities. We could do a lot with this extra money, including reducing carbon emissions, developing Oyster Card-style public transport ticketing, and improving rural bus services. Devolution is a journey, not a one-off event. Experience from other areas like Greater Manchester and the West Midlands shows that devolution opens the door to greater powers and funding over time. For example, the government has already announced a fourth level of devolution which would grant even more powers and funding opportunities. This first deal would pave the way for more deals in the future. It's important that you have your say about the proposals for devolution in Suffolk. We will run a public consultation between the 18th of March and the 26th of May. You can complete the survey online or in hard copy. More information about the key elements of the deal and how to respond is available at suffolk.gov.uk devolution. Empowering Suffolk's Future